Fraipon Abo, a two-day agreed business training. And if you look at the way I stress it, the word business is emphatically expressed there. Reason being that, yes, in the then she in Dhaka, in Arugu, and you move under no no Arugu, Arugu Manaka. Hello, <laughs> Aso kwa ne nwani o, o kwa ne trumpet neke no no. Ishu ko na mlo sanye kwa no no. Si fob na kwa sanye kwa ne. Sanye no kwa ne trumpet. Ne bula yu shokpa. Kete, anye dine ul yugu. Kashi na anye dine ebo. Ufun na lanyi ebo no tu ane. Ebo nye bo umeni, oko. Ke ya, ke ufukbo kuru bo EZT, Development Union. Ya bonde chon organisu obodo o kwa ne. Wari kuni si wali kinguwe po bachi nebe wali wili kwa nendo kwa ne jiwefe ba yani alu gune anya naro ajaji adi joge kene ne kene shiwe na kwa swa mbene swa biko swa fuji swa guani ne onye jifu ni yana kana mare obya sone leno na de kwa nendi ba yeye kani na mare fe ne meni abalu alu gune kamare ukwa. Kabo ugi aine biro na ruaya ajaji dije soge kina na gua unyobu nene na kwa chonyo kwa ne trumpet soke ngundi kuna la birunje bema kwa fursa ifemini ne moife ke alu gona ajaji ne banya nubo jika wu share gua. Noani ono ne biro koro koro kanya kibu ono ne na kau ne chichi kuneka. Happy to run a different kind of way and also collaborate. But we take this issue. I come across some work and experience. Some work and some foolish. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. We are not going to be able to do that. Nanti ada bapak pergi ke tempat yang bukit je, bukit itu. Hendak sih nunggu nampi aku ke UK, ya mau kapi, mau kaka mani, mau ke kocinya, mau ke sapa, mau ke sapa dah, mau ke apa, mau ke Lagos, mau ke Shu State, mau ke Abuja. Biko program nak kaya ni mungkin masuk musim di bawah mana deh. Kalau nak ini kan ini kan cipak. Who can lose the teeth also recognize 
Even if I'm an arrow, I'm doing my work. Also, as well, you need to do the mayor. No, yeah, but you need to do a test and all right, you pull it down. You pull it as well. Oh, she's doing a little mini family problem. That she's going to be one of the pushing behind every successful man. That's a woman. I like a chicken milk.
Aga, nka kwano si menema epiko luta kono ako komo roba. Meni yama nukuku ukuku. Epu komo kuishi. Epu komo kuishi tita koroba ne uta komo nusi tuno. Kwe mono ni Lagos, wamo ni motor komo no. Una dono ni thirty three years in Lagos. Kore tani. After thirty three years ona sano. On a son, no, 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 A year and six months. But that's what we want to be. We want to be able to take care of the people. Chief, I got one of the white guys. I'm so not going to do that. Look well. Let who's in charge know any one of the people there. I signed that in the book. Who she? They get the. I'm on the money because we're not doing it. Okay, we're not doing it. It's a good one. We're not doing it. A church in the back of Lagos. The Joroy who never got no money. You remember, if you never got any money, any good maker, you will be picked up. Of you, you will see the good food from the bay, if you don't have to find any money, you will see the good food. If you don't have to find any money, you will see the good food. If you don't have to find any money, you will see the good food. If you don't have any money, Part of my last card in my account, but the love and passion of many, the people who need it. Love and passion. Who can she? If I'm funny, who can I not be? Who can say it? We can do anything we need. I'm not going to say that I'm not going to. I forgot my own body. My body, my body, my body, my body, my body, my body. Kau cakap macam mana nak kalau kau cakap kau 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 tak? Aku kau mewah kini kau mewah mana? Aku ini. Ni kalau ada ni, ibu ni nak naro, aku ni naro. Aku kau mewah ni naro ya. But aku ni orang ibu, foto si ni dia malu naro tak. So ibu kena ni buat sen, aku sen si. Aku nak si, aku nak si, aku nak malu fener dulu. Kau pun ada nak malu naro. But I will say, if you don't fall when you don't make the rebel, who knew when they were on the economy, if I didn't have more? And then they could see my money flow, and they could see the next question. But, what do you mean if you don't have more? Or if you don't have more, or if you don't have more, or if you don't have more? And then they don't have more. You can read it in the cheap way, scan the people. Or when you say, if you don't have more, or if you don't have more, or if you don't have more, she came out and go come on. You may be to go here. Oh, I should see the neck. I go shiny. That come on. But because he beat on the mayor. I was a different enemy. Oh, my tenant. A different facet of it. It ain't in me. We let you only go. In the end, you will be in it. We will give our world. We will give us you again. And then I talk. We will not have our own. We will not have our own. Go to the law. Kena ni tu ni utak kono ni belum belum enggak mana mana. Aini oh oh mana mana orang orang ni fikir semua sebab kita orang ni. Inci dia, orang Amerika ni sekarang ni orang museji ni ada ni ada orang museji ni. Kaya ni tu ni kok. Orang ni orang museji ni ada ni ada orang ni asal museji ni mana. So, if you kena kaya kerja ni, orang ni kau mahu ni dia nak zoom, orang ni tak video nak zoom. Orang ni ni ke pura sih sih orang nak zoom ya. O chinês é igual, o marido não me deleia. O dia de amor, lu o que dá que tu não naia. O que ele fez foi passar a tia e o tema na fire. O meu filho não lembra. O pai não foi raspar. O pro empréstimo não lembra. O filho não lembra o que ele fez. Acho que ele vai sair. Picolé, a mãe não me pode nascer. Nascer. Porque a coisa que ele fez, ele não lembra o que ele fez. Kutaya, kubunua kwa saya, 
or with any antigen training element, or with any safety tips, and it's supposed to be any men. Because even now, I'm in the neighborhood. It's a good neighborhood, it's a good neighborhood. Toilet, if I'm going to make it easy, many. Don't look back to the Can you? Can you be good? Can you be good? I've been doing it, I've been doing it. I think I look my friend and I'm going to go to the So, can you be good? Only in Alaska, I think I talk about Alaska in the beginning. Only in the phone, I talk about the app because here in the silent. So that all can distract him also. And if you don't know, Mariko, the little speech in the beginning. And it goes, ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, and fellow members of the city community. I, Chief Akko Gossens, am truly elated to stand before you today, filled with an overwhelming sense of fulfillment and joy. We have gathered here for a momentous occasion, a two-day agricultural business training event, which I have had the honor of organizing in collaboration with the Safety Development Forum. Over the course of today and tomorrow, our purpose is clear. We aim to unlock the boundless potentials of agriculture for our people. We intend to awaken the I can do spirit within each of us and explore the countless opportunities that lie in cultivating the bountiful soil that God has bestowed upon us. Our ultimate goal is to transform Moses Yotakono into the hub of agricultural products in Delta State, reaping immense benefit along the way. This workshop is a treasure trove of knowledge, covering a wide spectrum of topics, ranging from crop production to export business and everything in between. Whether your interest lies in snail farming, poultry, fish, or any other exciting avenue, rest assured there is something here for everyone. As we commence this today of intensive training, our vision, is to, our vision is to revitalize farming practices in our community, making local and almost say to not a destination hall for agricultural businesses. You to the myriad of business opportunities that agriculture offers, not only as an alternative source of income, but also as a means of acquiring essential skills achieving self-reliance and creating employment opportunities. This training will empower farmers to harness new technologies, increasing agricultural productivity significantly. The impact of this training will be evident in increased productivity, reduced cost through integrated farming practices, time savings, enhanced knowledge, higher income and expand network opportunities. We recognize that two we, we recognize that two days may not be enough to cover all that needs to be addressed. Therefore, I urge the executive of the Executive Development Forum to consider making this an annual event. Inviting guest facilitators and the Delta State Ministry of Agriculture for continuous education and advisory support. Our facilitator, Mr. Juan Paul Ikechuku, widely known as former I, has shared his wealth of experience across the country and even beyond our borders. I encourage each of you to fully engage and absorb the wealth of knowledge he has to offer. Additionally, we are privileged to have two directors from the Ministry of Agri who will enlighten us on the invaluable opportunities of partnership and sourcing items from Delta State Agricultural Procurement Agency. The general manager of the Delta State Agricultural Agency will guide us on assessing grains and seedlings to ensure to enrich our experience further. Accomplished members of our community who have excelled in agriculture will generously share their expertise with us. As we embark on these upcoming days of learning, I urge you to focus on the horizon of possibilities. Agriculture is not just cultivating crops, it's about nurturing dreams and harvesting success. 
actively participate, ask questions, and build connections with your fellow participants. In, com in closing, I extend my deepest gratitude to my wife, Mrs. Akoko Anese, for her unrelenting support and those who made this event possible, including Kukweji Francis, Chief Nathaniel Chile, Haja Oshan, Omoni Johnson, Alaji Okon Francis, and Chibuzo Kaide, who served as dedicated members of the organizing committee. Special thanks also goes to the Chief, to Chief Joseph Lebinu and Chief Okwiji Francis Obute for their generous financial contributions. And to all our sons and daughters who provided unwavering support, I encourage all of us to embrace the motto, see something, do something. I hope, I hope that this program, I hope that programs like this continues to come to empower our community. This definitely shall not be the last. Finally, let's seize the opportunity that lies ahead and embark on this journey towards prosperity together. Welcome and let the journey to prosperity begins. Ladies and gentlemen, my little speech. And I encourage us once again, please dispose yourself, talk to each other. Um, part of the things that we've been talking about here, like I said, we invited um, two directors from the Ministry of Agri. Although, as at this moment, um, one of them is still shaky because they are not confirmed whether they will be coming or not. But tomorrow, the one person that is coming for tomorrow has confirmed that he will be here. Why we invited them is for you to see the potentials, the potential opportunities that are found that you can tap from Ministry of Agri Delta State. Um, Delta State. There is uh, this lady that is coming. If she doesn't come, we'll still continue to sustain her link. He has started his own poultry business. The chickens are about to be getting ready to be sold. Um, looking down, I just seen our elder here. We invited him to share along with some of our elders. They will come and share their environment of experience. Uh, I was telling the general here, if I wasn't married already, I would have looked for a wife here. Alright, um, like you know, my name is Fama Ai. E.K. Chukunwankwe is my name, but I'm popularly known as Fama Ai. Just like you have Dr. Ifan, Barrister, so 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 so, architect, so so so. So I choose to add Fama to my name to show us that it's a honorable business. Yes. Today we have people that are going to school. Many of them are not studying agriculture. I think this is one of the best course to study in school these days. Why? Because you need to produce. And when you produce, you sell. The Bible says something that he gives seed to the sower and bread to the eater. So if you have seed and you sow, you will produce bread. So you will be the one selling, but somebody that is eating, you just give the person only bread. The person will eat. Tomorrow the person will need to eat another one again. Today, we are going to be discussing about agri-business, integrated farming system. We are the owners of three reputable farm estates. Just like you have your farms, we own farm estates, where we have different people come together in a particular community to farm. We have in Buari, in Abuja, we have in Ogun State, with Ogun 131 acres of land. One acre of land is six plots of land. In Wasimi, we have 65 acres of land. So what we do is call people to come to the community to farm. We show them what to do, and we see how we can guide them so we can achieve excellence in the business of 
agriculture. I believe every one of us here must have known one or two things about agriculture. Emanon koni henana, or rearing of animals also. But one thing we do is we just do agriculture without doing the business. That's why today we're talking about agri-business. The difference between agriculture and agri-business is the business there. We know the main reason why you go into business is to do what? To make profit. And to even maximize profit. Agri-business is the application of business mindset in agriculture. If you want to be a good businessman, you must be able to document everything about your business. Number one, proper record keeping. You don't just go to farm, plant your yam, you don't know how much you bought the yam, you did not record it. When the yam is harvested, you don't know how many tubers that you have harvested or the cage of the two that you have harvested, you start giving out the yams to people. That is not agri-business. In agri-business, even if you want to give gifts to people, you must know how much is that worth of that yam you record it. So agriculture, we want to discuss about today, we want you to see it as a business that you will want to go into. So I will tell us some of the reasons why you must invest your time, your energy, and your money into the business of agriculture very soon. How many of us did agriculture in secondary school? We have a subject called agriculture, you know, in secondary school. Uh -huh. University, you know, you equally learn about some certain things in agriculture. Agri-business, they taught us from school is different from what we are going to be discussing today, as in partly different from what we are going to be discussing today. They also told us about shifting cultivation. Okay, they told us about bush following, that he continued on this particular land, at a time you allow it to stay so that grasses will just grow. After some time, you come back to the land again, bush following. Then we call it about mixed cropping. All those systems are aimed at making the soil to produce more for human consumption. But what we want to discuss about today surpasses all of them, and you we are not taught about this thing now in school. So the definition I'm going to give you now is not in any book, except the book I'm writing now good integrated farming system. So you will not see that definition in any book, but it's my personal definition. So you may not have time to write, but if you have time to write, okay, just write it so we can keep that at the Integrated farming system is the system of agriculture. Integrated farming system is the system of agriculture. Where plants, where plants and animals, where plants and animals are kept in a particular farm, where plants and animals are kept in a particular farm for a mutual benefit. I will explain that to you. Where plants and animals are kept in a particular farm for a mutual benefit, such that the waste of the plants become impute for the animals such that the waste of the plants become impute for the animals. And the waste of the animals 
input for the plant. In order to reduce waste, in order to reduce waste, comma, reduce cost, comma, in order to reduce waste, comma, reduce cost, maximize profits, maximize profits, and to produce organic food. The definition of long life. Sweet. <laughs> All right. Let me explain now. What integrated farming system is, is a system of agriculture where you as a farmer, you keep both plant and animal. You don't just keep the farm only like that is the palm tree. Inside this palm tree, you can integrate it with goats. Because the palm tree has grown, the goats will not eat the palm tree. Okay? When you cut your eagle down, right, the goats will be eating those eagle. It will not be wasted. I don't know what they call it here. Good. The goats will be eating it. It will not be wasted. When the goats poo, it becomes a manure for the soil. So integrated farming is the system of agriculture where plants and animals are kept in a particular farm for a mutual benefit so that the plants and animals will be benefiting from each other. And you are doing it in order to reduce your waste. If you are growing only goats, you'll be having lots of goat poop that is a waste. You spend money to pack them and throw them away. If you are producing only palm tree, for example, when you cut those eagles, you know, they fall down, you gather them, you burn them. It's also a waste. In order to reduce waste, that money you would have used in buying the goat food, you will save it because some part of the goats are eating some grasses in that plantation. So you've saved cost, you've reduced your waste, sorry, then you have also reduced your cost of production. Then you have maximized your profit because a business, normally they teach us, they taught us that um, if you want to get profit, selling price minus cost price is equal to profit. That is the gross profit now. So if you reduce your cost, you have increased your profits. Depend on other expenses that you incur. Then you have also succeeded in producing organic food. It's in trouble. If you say the soil and the talk, you will stand and they shout every day. Why? We have so much food fertilizer in it. I mean inorganic fertilizer. We buy this NPK, we buy the urea, we infuse them in energy drink, thanks to us. If you do hard work, you're a farmer, you do mechanic, you do some hard work and all that. Sometimes you go by here. We need to learn to dig a well before we are tested. Let's plant this seed before we are hungry. Do they have people want to make money? Shout, shout. I do tell people, agriculture is not the fastest way to become rich. If you want to become rich, shout, shout. And I don't get it. I'm Robert D. The map has said, you know. <laughs> become rich, shout, shout. But agriculture is the fastest way to get out of poverty. Why? Because you produce at least what you eat. It provides you shelter for your home. It gives you money for you to clothe yourself. We need to learn how to dig a well before we are dirty. Let's try to do something with our hands. Even God, God for Bible say, I will bless the work of your hands. Then I call it added. 
that the reason why we can leave will be like this life don't tire me. I don't cry for Nigeria. I don't even know what to do anymore. But it's something you know how to do that you are not doing. How many of us here know Abadu as in Oka? Come on. We know Oka now, right? Yeah. So plant corn. How many of us here don't know how to plant corn? <coughs> come now. Who don't know how to plant corn? Don't be shy. If you know. Okay, you don't have to plant corn. Two seeds per hole, right? Go. No much time than two seeds. If you put four, if one of them germinates, then we put two. Or if it's the state of your proper production. So if you put two seeds per hole and the two plants grows up, or one grows up, in one corn corn, how many seeds do you count inside? At least 400 seeds. At least 400 seeds. Now you have testified that you know how to plant corn. Why are you not planting it? Why are you not doing it at a large scale? Because for you to get 400% return on investment, I don't think that business is a bad thing. You plant one seed, you get 400. I think it's a good business. So why are we not doing it? So most of what we say we are frustrated is because we don't want to think or practice what we know. So today we are not going to teach you something you don't know before. We are going to teach you something you know and a better way to do it, right? Some of us here will watch the video of uh, Yang and Bad. Good. I came here and saw you planting wonderfully well. You are planting yam, and I saw some big yam too. I believe it is harvested from here. Yes. Uh -huh. Then I was asking the MC yesterday, what about the stress of digging this yam? Because when you want to harvest the yam, you plant straight on the flat floor, you will need shovel. You will need hope. Sometimes you may need a digger. But if you plant yam on a heap, it's very easy for you to get the yam out and take it out. Then if you now plant it on a bag, let's say like uh, the general house now, when we are going to ASCD, you see the whole place is in color. Anyone can sow and reap. Anyone can go into the business of agriculture. One thing I like about farming is it does not say you are from Kumwe uh, City, right? Okay. Kumwe <laughs> State. Good. It does not say because you are Igbo or Hausa or Yoruba, let me produce well for this person. No. Once you sow it, you will reap. Everyone can do it. So, we should know that. Now, sometimes also in agriculture you lose. Just for you to know, sometimes things happen, you lose. Then you come back again. But this the book I read, wonderful book, written by John C. Maxwell. He said, sometimes you win, other times you learn. Not do. <clears throat> Other times you learn. And the final law says if you don't sow, you don't reap. That's the last law of If you don't sow, you don't reap. As I mentioned the book, let me only recommend some book for us, for those way to run lane. Two books that changed my life, number one is Think and Grow Rich. Think and Grow Rich. It's by a man called Napoleon Hill. It's a very good book. Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Number two 
is rich dad, poor dad. How many of us are really good here? Rich dad, poor dad. Okay. How many of us are in university where you don't have that book, rich dad, poor dad? Anybody here? You need university. Your energy will be totally business of agriculture. Number one reason is that agriculture is an evergreen business. I tell people it's the oldest business in the world. I was invited to a church to do the agri presentation, and I was telling them, telling the pastor, the very business, that those that are not family may not go to heaven. Which one here? Which one here? Who stick when it's in the grow? You eat fresh vegetables. Before now, if you eat too good eh, vegetable soup, you just be sweating around at the night. But now after eating vegetable soup, you go to the toilet. It's not because the vegetable soup is bad, but the chemical used in growing those vegetables. If I'm a, 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 a farmer now, I want to pay for the sharp sharp in the business of vegetables, and paste, eh, let's say like some insects are attacking my home, I will go and spray uh, uh, chemicals there. Yeah. When I spray chemicals, the thing come on, the next tomorrow, I will go to the grocery store. You don't buy, you don't know. But that chemical is written in the bottle 24 days. Some of them 14 days. Put this on that vegetable. That is believer. You don't go chop that vegetable till that number of days. How will you take a washing go when you buy it? Do they use soap? No. They use cheap common. And you just put another and put another and put another and put another soup, right? That's how you get those problems. You can grow it at home by yourself. I would you simply go charm the body. You grow it at home. They grow wide. You don't need for the life at the ground. Oh no, very simple. Don't pass the city to grow. We can anticipate for you every day to find the next slide. It's for everybody, both the rich and poor. Like I mentioned before, everybody can go into what agri business. You will not say, hey, from an eye, you plant here. Because you from an eye, I don't go to you. Okay, I can't go to plant this one. Maybe I'll go to this No. Agriculture is not a good passion. You're going to become an employer of labor. To start family, you only people who make people clever. You only people invite from seed company. They have employees here. You need people that will help you do some riches if you don't do them by yourself. During harvest, you need people that will help you harvest. If we are serious as we are now here, and we go back and concentrate in the business of agriculture. This community will change in within two years. They will know this community as an agrarian community. Ah, go by this thing, go to this place and tell them that. We all need to be part of this development. Let's go. We have some of the best soil in the world. Look outside, everywhere green. Look inside, everywhere green. Even the tide roads, eh? the soil is very rich that the seed when they inside they shoot out of the asphalt. We have some of the best soil in the world. The only country that has better soil than Nigeria. It's the poorest country in the world. And that's the DR Congo. They say those don't get in No service to them. The 
have to soil. Look at country like Israel, a desert nation, hills, mountains everywhere. They are growing crops, supplying to other countries. Israel. Come to Dubai. We know Dubai is a desert nation before. Today, Dubai is going into a large greenhouse farming system. So my to tell us more about greenhouse when we talk about sustainable production. That one involves money. If you get money, you do greenhouse. What if you harvest in one plot of greenhouse, you will not harvest it in 10 plots of open field. In the Dubai people are going into massive greenhouse system. In the Nebra, it will take more job than it has created. You know how many people you want for bank before only the work again and again? Because of ATM. Ah. In fact, these bank people, they prefer to use POS people. Because POS people know their association. They know the most price. And they know they pay their salary. When last you write a letter from send to somebody in my post? When well, last you see a writer, technology has come to stay. But while the earth remains, seed time and harvest shall not cease. There is no technology that will come now that will replace food. You will be hungry. You will always be required to sow and reap. As the point told before, technology will only make agriculture better if you don't replace it. I was in the forum and I told people that soil is not even required to grow crops. Why? Because what crop needs to grow is three things. Crop needs water, humidity. It needs light, water sunlight or LED light, and nutrients. The only function of the soil is that the soil is a holding medium to hold the water, to hold the nutrients. That is the only function of the soil. So if you get a medium that will hold the water and hold the nutrients, you can actually grow crop. That is why today we have something called hydroponic system. It is the root of the carrot plant that we take in as vegetable. Although it leads to, it's also edible. We all know that Vegetables are of health importance. It has various health importance. We, I think many of us have heard about that. And we take vegetables regularly, you visit the hospital less. Vegetables, uh, regular eating, you control your blood pressure. So I have all this, uh, I have an attack, I have all this. Somebody that takes vegetables regularly, we don't have such disease. Even children. We grow very, very sharp and, you know, when you give them consist, uh, constant vegetables as part of their meal. Even nursing mothers, it is very, very important when you eat it, and so on and so forth. So apart from the health benefits, which you can still all go to, because you have the same time, vegetables is also financial importance. One of the agricultural enterprises that you don't need large expanse of land, I mean, especially crop production, the area of crop production that you need that expert of land to grow before you can start making money is vegetable. And vegetable can guarantee you about 200% of investment. That's why we analyzed uh, some of you know, these 4,000 square meters. That's one acre. A plot of land is 660 square meters, like 60 by 120.
of God with the President General of the Umu City Sons and Daughters residing here in uh, Nigeria and all over the world. So, Kete, I'm be an shikani of one who sends a cargo. We are conceiving the idea of uh, this agri-business uh, training. 
So they are actually coming in collaboration with uh, the ZT Forum, which by extension I'm the President General. Yakai and now, Yakai uh, Bian. So training Yakai Bian is a kind of workshop, a seminar to encourage people, to educate people on how to increase their farming capacity. They mentioned, they call it uh, uh, agri business. Because we go by the bridge, we go from any car to the road from by here. We go in Manaka, we go there. We go there. We go there. Better from the swabeg. We are the actual people. We are the converting farming into commercial uh, benefit. Okay. Opportunity <laughs> Only when I did it, I was say opportunity work in Meshi group farming. I graduate to having number of persons to come together because the, uh, the facilitators they told us that it is better to work as a team. So this opportunity for us, even if you are in diaspora, you can finance groups here. You are a stakeholder in that farm, but you will encourage them because it's uh, capital intensive. So people would like to invest money. So obviously you go in the venue and endeavor to encourage people to go into farming because I feel great. So Jike Mene Benebuna Dine, Wene Nyatye, Kadoje Boreni, Ife Manu Mweni, Ya Wosebe Yo Boreni, Odine Go Ki Mweni, Wosebe Yo Boreni, Odine Ideas Ki Mweni, Wosebe Yo Boreni, Ki Ekpe Se Kpeli Gwe, Benu Boreni Ekpeli Ki Ajay Nisi, Yo Otoro, Ndiya Dike Yo Tueni, Anwacho Nwa Ni Mefi Ke Yo Boreni, Bukita Na Ku Uni Meki Provision, So That Ndiya Biya Kone Na Follow Up. So Mbare Nisi Gwe, Mbare Nisi Gwe, can I name you a patent you can from far? Can they can name it? Natural courage or science, she let's go into farming. When you was managing director of the women with a farm with bars on my, you blame the Kiddy Boss in the Zunda Gujin. I found both Chief Nathaniel Chime, member the president, who city community in Lagos. If a bus and Mobodo, can you get ten? First and foremost, Mobodo, can you Mobodo, could you go to city? If I did, I'd be make a table, God see one, set chief sense, I did a cocoa. Then I do, see if in the orphanage, when the many Abuja, Lagos, so trying to go to say or good any. Uh, to be frank, oh, make only this same program in Lagos, in school here in Lagos, about six months ago. Uh, I was part of the two days program. And Oganum Jenny, if one of the things Oganum was a come observe all the program, on the Lucy, okay, we say you will go. It took me well, and uh, I was very impressed by what I saw. And uh, as I speak to you now, the Bilogon in the machine, what has more family now? She, you know, no. Okay, let me tell you the program in Lagos or Guam's here are very, very okay. Yeah, but don't worry. I've been there to seek with the man there. Probably I'll teach, come and teach members of the community how to fish. It's not enough to give somebody fish. It is better to teach somebody how to fish. Because if you teach him how to fish, he will fish for the rest of his life. So and so far it has been very impressive. It has been very impressive. The arrangement was for let's see how we can get a hundred persons to attend this event. We said each family to bring four four people, each branch of Umu City all over Nigeria to bring two two people, and so we're looking at a hundred. But what did we get at the end of the day? 
we got 122 people registered for this program. And we have in attendance today, because I personally counted, 113 people are in attendance. And for me, that is 95%. Then for the resource persons, the two lectures we have had, it's been very enriching. Uh, and Elaine uh, Elaine fire. I'm sure at, this, at the end of this program, the life of our people here will no longer be the same. I know most of them are farmers, but farmer, farming when you level. So at least Elaine will be and then I could go away. Some of the new modern techniques in farming. I mean, when I go and you say, how can I mark an ATG? Ni me bag. Because a space where you will put 22 bars of yam, you plant 22 bars of yam. If you plant it in a bag, you can plant 52 bars of yam. I believe you should get. So our sincere thanks and appreciation goes to our son, Chief Sense, Ajay Akogo. Omenuko of Mum City. On Azai Fire. On Azai Fire. Apart from many other things that he has been doing for this community, this is another big plus. So he's doing wonderfully well. Our prayer for him from this community is that the good Lord will continue to bless him for us, continue to protect him, continue to guide him continue to uphold him and continue to keep him for us. All this we ask in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you very much. Ajay Manare. Ajay Bra. Piko Kikwanye. And you never say she was one of the participants in the KK. Kikwanye. Yeah, I found a good blessing in China. I found a good blessing in China. We reached out to this person. Hey, hello, buddy. Get out of here. I know you should be one of the participants. We go on the phone in the morning. We left for dash. We left for dash. We left for dash. We left for dash. We dash. We left for dash. We left for dash. We left for dash. This seminar or the very, very interesting. In fact, if a moron is so far, who be at the full wide, a baby can she narrow can she hope what they were. But if in the morning, a baby, a barren man, she if in the house of question and itself, I need to let a party go. So, naked. And then I organize this uh, program, this seminar. A person of uh, Chief Sense Akogo, uh, and there's a whole to end this and making it this, making it short sure this program. Then it's very, very possible. So making it quick, because she need to energy, because she need to energy. Ngo fumu ogwe hu nebe nebe no no ma mamji no ro ibo unka pa ego when ke no rash nebe no na pa ego and apart from that me no mo ma she I ne yinja I ne we reserve ash you know so ona sume fa ni ibo she from the moment we ke je doro nebe na koro e bi do na practice if e money. In fact, I don't know if you can get a little bit of 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 a little Hello, buddy. Kete, show to talk. I didn't even know. Maybe we need some name or something. So, yes, we are in the middle of an interview about questions. Oh, because if I can, mama, I can do it. Let's see. Who get the money? Let's see. Can you call us? What the? Hello, buddy. Kete, I'm in the middle of an interview. I'm not feeling good. I'm not feeling good.
If I may make it a phone with Danny, if I want a two day agree business training, and if you look at the way I stress it, the word business is emphatically expressed there. Reason being that, yes, in the Buddha, she in Dhaka, in Arubu, and you will go to Arubu, Arubu, Manaka. Ebe Kubudeni but do not put in there. If you go for your bum, you will in there. so good, Obian. Our neighboring community, Mujin, a guru of people, you put in Lagos, a second scene. If you don't know, I talk any stop or undo where is you really go? If you don't know, Kayakuja, where Kakuja, where Amy Manaka, where you name where you go. The emphasis is youth opportunity in the agriculture the business angle of agriculture and profit profitable from it. program in their government, the name of the program down, may end up with us. But the Kenyan in there, or the Kenyan was a off man in the So in China, who drops you, Kobo, government, not sponsor a Kobo, in Bo, you need there by a Kobo, you to us now check. I think you will leave a Kenyan with Yashin Dobu, the Yaka, and in Malasha. Ben, you got joking, you don't know. If you mean a bush. Lagos go amu no maru mepike mena mena o amu ne no no bo na da ni no no ibo thirty three years ni Lagos ko reba nuasa kono nuasa ni ko wese ni ni ba maru budeni anya biya afamu rendo budeni ni bi esu gumwe bi o for consecutive one year six months no 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 budo kene e bu gumu kweishi ba gofu ni so ndi bemunde ba Bundo tu niji na arugu aina bofu na rutu arugu kena ndo rutu arugu abram da je oru ibu shi gan na choru ibu eje irem bwe kuko kete mbu chata da accountant kete ifende ebende niji na fufu na ere o burende jine ibu akunji ni kusi kumbi sisi agricultural business. If you don't marry for me, where will you marry you go? Where will you marry you go? I'm going to say, "Neku si wamaro ro gunaro." Yes, wamaro go ro gunaro. But if you don't have a son, and you choose to marry you, you marry you go. You marry 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 you
This man is an international figure. He's been in London, he's been in the US, he's been all over the world. He's an entrepreneur himself, he's, a, he's an employer of labor, he has hotels and he has various other sorts of businesses. But today he's seated humbly here in the midst of every other person trying to also further acquire knowledge because of the content and the viability of what we have brought on board. So I'm happy that indeed I collaborated with the Executive Forum. It is not possible for just one person to start and end this job. You need collaborators, you need persons to give you advice, you need persons to help you make contact, you need somebody to help you coordinate. For example, my wife is also here, whom I'm indeed very happy about. On the second, on the, um, uh, on the uh, what is it called? The uh, provision of food and the rest of other things and logistics, the registration and um, uh, registration, accreditation. She's been the one handling all of it. So it is not possible for me to say I am a sole convener. Yes, I conceived the idea. I am the convener, but then I've collaborated with so many persons who have given me their corporations. And indeed, I will want to mention here particularly Chief Obuji, especially Chief Obuji gave us financial contributions. Chief Joseph Ebinum from Lagos also gave us financial contributions. And I owe them so much gratitude, gratitude, gratitude. Mbeni, thank you very much. So, if you don't know about Oge Kenya, and you have to follow the LA order, see our government, the ATA can be Kenya. So, when they move to, when ATA can be here, they are going to be with the convener, the mayor. So, Oge Kenya, I can't even keep going to Kenya. Because we are going to be able to get the ATA to be here. Chukuna Corona Gani, Omaro Neme, can you be fair, John? If you can show one of the trumpet and show me. Ofu Marundeke, Kene, 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 both financially, his advice, his disposition, and even being here physically. Uh, the Vice uh, Gen President General, she does not be able to Vincent Okose, and my life president, um, Chief Nathaniel Chimi. This is somebody who attended this same similar project we organized in Lagos, and today he's here. I want to say that he was the one that gave me the assurance to go ahead that indeed our people will appreciate this project. And today we are here. A lot of times go to Chief, S uh, Chief Nathaniel uh, Chime. Thank you, thank you. If you watch this video, I say thank you. And to uh, Okwane Trumpet, thank you for coming. We've seen your videos in the past and we have this great assurance that the things you're doing, you're uplifting the culture and tradition of our people in Okwana, Okwana land. And not just our culture, but activities that are happening in our land. This is one good such examples that I want to ask my people, wherever you are, whichever amount of money you have, come back home, let us see something and do something. That is one magazine I have started to champion and I'm trying to um, allow and make our people to buy into. Here there are a lot of development for us, there are a lot of uh, avenues for us to develop our community. We don't have to come here and begin to travel kilometers away to go and get food, to go and get things like drinks, to go and get uh, um, just whatever they mention it. We need to come back home and give our people the necessary assurance and necessary support. Beyond agriculture, in education, we need to support ourselves. In enabling our, our, our youth to get employed, we need to encourage them and empower them. For those who need scholarship, they need to be given scholarship. For those who have read and have had the certificate, we need to make rooms for them to get employed and be gainfully employed. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. God bless you.